Hello all welcome back to SAP MN here we'll learn more about the interview questions for 3 plus years of experience so let us start how to delete the multiple purchase order at once in SAP SAP provides a mechanism to delete the bulk purchase orders so the answer is M E M A S S P O M E M A S P O and also you can use the mass t code and a mass t code you have to choose the purchase order moving on to the next question what is the t code to change the price of a material in sap to change the price of the material can be enforceable in t code mr22 the answer is mr22 Moving on to the next question. What is the differences between standard and moving average price? Generally, we recommend all the raw materials, spare parts, traded goods, etc., to be assigned to the moving average price because of the accounting practice and also to validate the inventory of such materials under moving average. Why? Because these materials are subjected to the price fluctuations often so you need to maintain them under moving average price if you maintain these under standard prices then the impact will be very much because the margins are minimized and we also need the variances analysis should be done to each material hence generally recommended that moving average price should be followed for raw materials roh spare parts ersa and traded goods hava etc like and also it recommends the semi finished goods halb and the finished goods are valued with the standard price because of the product cost angle so this is the explanation should be given when when you are asked to what is the differences between the standard price and moving average price standard price is denoted as s and moving average price is denoted as v moving on to the next question for which transaction key in the material management in the standard system the accounting group is active it is saying that there are multiple transaction keys like bsa bsax wrx KONS for the consignments and the so on. So it is asking for which transaction key the account grouping is active. The answer is GBP, the offsetting entry and also called as consumption. Moving on to the next question, which of the following stock types can be counted through the physical inventory procedure? We have a physical inventory that can be done with the t code mi01 to create the physical inventory procedure so we'll see the answer these are the top stocks to be counted for the physical inventory unrestricted used stock block stock quality inspection stock and vendor consignment stock these are the four stocks to be considered for the physical inventory procedure moving on to the next question i guess that's all Thank you all and do subscribe your subscription is a motivation to me to come up with many tricky questions and your interview will be smooth and you can answer and you will be capable of answering all the tricky questions thank you once again do like share and comment thank you